Hi everyone, how are you? Welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. Here is the question during a tricuspid valve repair, the right atrium is opened following establishment of the cardiopulmonary bypass. Which of the following structure does not lie within the right atrium? Though in this question, this scenario, but in the last line they want to know which does not or which don't lie within the right atrium so for this first of all we have to know details about the right atrium then we have to find out a structure which is not located in the right atrium so here are the options the options are pista terminalis tricuspid valve fossa ovalis trabecula carni and musculi pectoni so we have to find out first of all this structure which structure is right atrium then we have to find out a structure which is not located in the right atrium so in this picture we can see this is a hat and this part this open part is the right atrium and just here this is the left atrium here the right ventricle and left ventricle just behind it so now let's see the structure of this right atrium First of all, from above, we can see the superior vena cava. The superior vena cava open in the right atrium at this point. Then we can see the fossa opalis and limbus fossa opalis. So first of all, this is a egg-like structure. This egg-like depression and this egg-like depression is known as the fossa opalis. And the upper part of the fossa opalis is slight thick and it is known as the limbus fossa opalis. So superior vena cava fossa opalis limbus fossa opalis then we can see two another important structure one is the musculopectinity another one is the crista terminalis so here we can see these the rough area they are the musculopectinity and this line at the junction of the this muscular part and smooth part this is known as the crista terminalis and here we can see this is the inferior vena cava valve of the inferior vena cava then the valve of the coronary sinus and opening of the coronary sinus they all are located into the right atrium and also we can see this is the valve which is the tricuspid valve and it is located between the right atrium and the right ventricle and this valve known as tricuspid valve and it also located into the right atrium so these all structure are located in the right atrium again first of all superior vena cava inferior vena cava valve of inferior vena cava valve of coronary sinus opening of the coronary sinus then we can see musculi pectinity crista terminalis so they are all the structure which is located into the right atrium then we can see this is the cross section of the right ventricle and here this is the tricuspid valve it connect with the papillary muscle to this quadra tendinary muscle and finally papillary muscle it attached to the ventricular wall and we can see the wrap area here this is called the trabecula carni so wrap structure in the right ventricle is the trabecula carni and here we can see a moderator band also present so trabecula carni moderator band they are specific for the right ventricle so here Trabecula carni, uh, it is known to us that the trabecula carni, it is the structure which is located into the right ventricle, not atrium. So, the trabecula carni, it is not located into the right atrium. On the other hand, such as the crista terminalis, it is the junction point of smooth path and rough path, tricuspid valve, then fossa ovalis, muscular pectinity, they are located into the right atrium. And here we can see some of the structures such as the muscular pectinity, crista terminalis opening of the coronary sinus fossa ovalis they are located into the right atrium but tabula trabecula carni it is specific for the right ventricle thank you all